Hello everyone, I am Uzi Gorilla. This is The Witcher 3 Blood and Wine Expansion. I have some things to say, but I'm gonna jump right into it, see this introduction first. Then I got stuff to say. Uh, appeal to Sir Geralt. The bridge is chest. What? At the behest of our merciful sovereign? Sovereign? Yeah. Gracious. Gr a lust. Wow. Alright, whatever. Journey far north lay before you. Mission. Terrible monster appeared in the Dutch Duchy of whatever. God damn it. Already. Already. Only the most famous among witchers has the ability to destroy the beast. Thus, we humbly beseech you to appear in the village of Holloway, where we shall await you in full hope that you will deign to hear of our woes and liberate our lands. Your humble servants is whoever's. Okay. Right. Okay, well. I should have known this was going to be a thing. Oh man, this map is way too far zoomed in. I had to uninstall all my mods because they're all broken. Leave us be, we beg you. We ain't in need of no help. Uh, I think you might be in need of help. need for your help. Ah. Have no fear, good man. Our labors shall be done quickly. The prowlers to be banished for good. Milton, look. Get out. In the flesh. Hail, Witcher. Let us go inside and greet you as befits an old friend. And you, fear not. We shall put an end to the rule of outlaws soon. Found your message on a notice board. You see, Palmerin, I told you. The griffin at White Orchard. I knew that were we only to follow the tracks of its slayer, we would in the end find Geralt. Milton de Peyrac Perrin and Palmerin de Lanfor. Good to see you both. Been years. Be assured, we share your joy. You must forgive us our, uh, surroundings. When we pledged to place the village under our protection, the village elder gave us this hut as our lodgings. He swore it is the best hut in the village. Get involved in some squabble? We discovered that in retreating, the Redanian garrison that left this land still is at the mercy of numerous plagues. A tyranny of bandits, the most onerous among them. These plunderers shall soon descend on this village to collect tribute. Milton and I will dissuade them. We are both sworn to fight injustice and oppression wherever they rear their heads. The matter does not concern you, of course, but do us the kindness of waiting. Once we have dealt with these marauders, we have a matter we must present to you. So, plan to go out and meet the bandits when they arrive? Fight them? Parmaron wishes first to appeal to their sense of decency. <laughs> but I expect they will be deaf to this. Yeah, completely. We must afford them a chance to stand down. Many a hardened outlaw has left the path of wrongdoing upon hearing words of admonition. Doesn't happen in these lands. Ever. If they do not heed my reprimand, we at least will know we have done all within our means to evade bloodshed. Fine. Naturally, I'll help when Palmerin's rhetoric falls on deaf ears. Excellent. Then we've but to wait for the rogues to arrive. Things are coming! Hear that? Your bandits have arrived. Let us go out to greet them. <laughs> he mean us? I, Palmerin de Lonfall, call upon you to repent. Search your hearts. Do you not see that they are blackened? <laughs> Regular punch and duty here. To prey upon commoners is no honor. To loot their meager stores 
Abandon the path of shame, and we will spare you. <laughs> right, good jest, that. Had us a laugh. Now, fuck off while we lose our patience and you lose something else. Nay, <laughs> wait, Zorg. These lads are lark. Mayhaps they know some tricks. Oi, players! Can you toss balls all loopity like or, or do that thing where one spits fire while the other farts? <laughs> Noble Palmerin's giving you a chance. Now I'm gonna give you some advice. Do what he says. Or what? Or you'll find yourself fighting knights errant in the pay of the Duchess of Toussaint. And they eat scum like you with their morning porridge. Well, there's three of them. Two turtled up in armor. We'll come back later. Some wench sent them. Folk who say we's afeard of wenches and jesters. Ooh, insulted the Duchess. Not good. Indeed, we cannot let the affront go unpunished. I swear upon the heron you will pay with your own blood! By the crane, villains, ready your arms! For the glory of the grace, I shall make many of you! Let's go, Iggy. Yeah, I didn't want to say anything, but yeah, this is about going as well as I expected. Stop hitting me. Oh shit, I forgot my rune. My rune right. Where did all these bandits come from? Weren't there only three of them? Alright. Uh, I hate guy I hate guys with shields. I hate them with shields. Alright, no, ar no. Hard. Thank you. Ooh, decapitation. That's gotta hurt. Oof, there goes his arm. Yeah, they're dead. And stabbing the- yeah. Done. And this- oh, there's two of them. Of course there's two of them. Why do I- I need to just use Igni. Igni's usually better. Is that it? Where are all these bandits coming from? God damn it. Just let them burn, NPCs. They never learn. Alright. Why do they not emerge? It is over. We have banished the scoundrels. Lifted oppression's yoke from their lives. Warned you it'd be like this. Fear you as much as they did the bandits now. Sorry, no fanfares and flowers. You're not in Toussaint. Ugh. It is true what folk claim. In the north, no noble deed goes unthwarted. It is time to go home. And we shall, my friend. Come, Geralt. It's time we delivered our message. Wasn't there supposed to be a message? Wasn't me coming here the message? So fess up. What brings you such a long way? We are to deliver Her Grace the Duchess's message in full. With all due ceremony. For tradition? Is sacred in Toussaint. All right, <laughs> fine. Most honorable Geralt, slayer of monsters and all Ifels nefarious, which prey on the defenseless of this world. Whereas never have you been known to deny help to the innocent, nor leave widows and orphans to fates undeserved. Answer you now our present summons. Free us from the beast which floods our streets with blood and sows panic in the hearts of rich and poor alike. Come to our aid, Witcher. Thus humbly beseeches you the star-crossed city's most gracious protectress, her illustrious highness, Duchess Anna Henrietta. Okay. Shall you answer her call? This would be a very short let's play if I didn't, but is there anything Anna else? Henrietta really say all that? Word for word? Well, in point of fact, she said, bring me the Witcher and dare not spare your horses. Only make certain this time he comes alone. The Ducal Chamberlain added the rest. You know how it is. 
Yeah, I remember. I might add, be it unofficially, that a hefty reward awaits. Yet the specifics you will need to verify with her illustrious highness. Okay. So yeah, what am I getting, what am I signing up for? Might be the most fervent request that I take a contract ever. And the most polite. And now we've got all that behind us. I want to hear more about this beast. Some kind of monster? Just guessing. Most assuredly, though no one has caught a good look at it as yet, our only sure witnesses, bodies massacred in a brutal, horrid manner. Look, some sketches drafted from descriptions given by those who claim they glimpsed the beast. Each quite different. To my mind, these witnesses lie. How many victims so far? Two. When her grace learnt of the second, she discharged us immediately. It's a slender it, man. Promising grants of land and fortunes in gold, should you answer her summons. An ill wind blows, Geralt. The beast cannot be tracked. Folks say it wields black magic. Also, both victims were nobly born, and the start of a tourney draws near. Uh, yeah, what's this about a tournament? What? Mentioned a tourney. Why doesn't the Duchess just call it off? Simply, it is too late. The guests have arrived. The best knights of all lands, relatives of the Emperor. Sounds like a... The beast could be a okay. threat to others, not just to her grace's subjects. Got it. For an aristocrat dies, at best it's a scandal. At worst, a diplomatic incident. I still don't understand why they couldn't just call the whole thing off. I mean, just because everyone's there doesn't mean you can't call it off. Or postpone it. That works too. Uh, has anyone tried? I'm sure someone has. Anyone tried to hunt it? Knights Errant, for example? Ha! Many have tried. Baiting, waiting in ambush, but to no avail. The beast is clever. It evades all traps and attacks of a sudden. It is like a ghost. An experienced tracker. This is what we need. With knowledge of monsters. In short, we need you. Uh, yeah, might be a vampire something or other. Or Slenderman there. Could be Slenderman. Beast wields black magic? What makes you say so? The first victim vanished between bites at a feast. Of the feast goers, none noticed this. They saw but an open window, then heard desperate cries from the street below where a corpse had just been found. The second killing, similar. A knight in a locked room. Servants all about the house. Guards all around the estate. Yet the beast somehow got him out, dragged him to the town square, and killed him there. No one saw, nor heard, a thing. We have no fear of creatures against which sword and shield protect. But of this beast, nothing is known. Safe that it cannot be traced. Kills effortlessly, and with no rhyme or reason we can discern. Yeah, sounds like someone who can go invisible. A contract. I'll take it. Uh, I sometimes think back to all the contracts I've ever taken from sovereigns. Can't name hardly any where I came out ahead. You cannot be thinking to refuse. Uh, no. Just struck by a thought. How the Duchess can sometimes be... Mm, demanding. So you accept the contract? Excellent! We must set off at once. We long wanted this land searching for you. Yet time is of the essence. Ready to go, soon as you're packed. Ha! Ah, then post haste to Toussaint. To Toussaint! Toussaint! Oh, our French. Uh, you're not doing a very good job, whatever you're doing, peasant. I keep trying to... I, I want to post the intro with no commentary, so I feel like I don't have to say anything. But in post, I can just remove it. I can remove that audio track. Yeah, sounds like a vampire to me. It also might be that all of the promo footage has been vampire related like, so maybe that could be why I think vampire. I don't think it's that, probably not that big of a secret really. It's everything else that goes with it that will be interesting. The land of fluff and wine. Exactly how I remembered it. Now my question is, I'm sure this is a book thing. You'll find Beauclair has changed some these past years. Walk about when you have the chance. You will see for yourself. To me, place always seemed straight out of a fairy tale. Knights errant, elven palaces. You insinuate that we are somehow odd? I shall prove you wrong. 
This I pledge on the heron. Someone's in a hurry. Whoa, a Cyclops. <laughs> Well, that's impressive. Oh, well, that didn't. <laughs> I thought he might be dead. How foolish of me. What the fuck is this thing? Giant, maybe? Yeah, it's too... Eh, is it too big for a Cyclops? I don't think so. Am I going to have to fight this? Is that what I'm doing here? Yep. Goldiat? Yeah, yeah. Okay, shit. Well, he can't be burned. I dodged. Great. Uh-huh. Whoa, 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 what? Okay. That was unexpected. Nope. 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 Oh, okay. At least I'm not stunned. Usually they mock me away like that and I'm stunned. Interesting I have to use a silver sword on him. What the hell is... Okay. I don't think he's supposed to twist like that. What the hell? Big beast. Tackling it single-handed. None too wise. Neither is love born of wisdom, Witcher. So, Guillaume, out with it. Which fair damsel inspired you to vow to kill that filth? <laughs> the most beautiful among them. If he wishes to guard her name a secret, he need not reveal it. You I do not know, sir, nor seem you a knight, yet still I am profoundly grateful, nay, indebted to you for your succor. Sucker? This trophy, sir, is yours. Uh... How did... yeah, why A why giant is, this what? close to human settlements? Strange. Well, that was no ordinary giant. His name was Goliath. Rumored to have been a knight once, but one who broke his vows. For this, the Lady of the Lake transformed Ooh. him into a wild giant and banished him into the Gorgon Hills. So he came back down? Why? Several times each year, hunger chased him into the lowlands. Goliath had killed and devoured many shepherds. Guillaume's hunt served a noble cause. At any rate, it's a tale for more agreeable environs. Yeah. Okay. I'll take the trophy. Why not? Could find someone who'll pay to buy it. Put up a good fight against the giant. Got experience battling monsters? None. In Tucson, we mostly chase bandits. But I vowed I'd bring my heart's champion the head of a monstrosity, as the famed Gottfried, known as the Giant Killer, did. You don't mean to hunt the beast, I hope. The matter's best left to Geralt. Another challenge awaits me. Yet if Geralt is to hunt the beast, he ought to know. It struck again. Of course it has. The river surrendered a corpse. It washed up in the meander by the cockatrice. Damien de la Tour's guardsmen are there already, securing the area. Securing the area? Better go there now before they trample any tracks, manhandle any evidence. Set forth, then. I shall ride for the city to inform her gracious magnificence that Geralt has arrived. We'll meet later, near Guillaume's tent at the Tourney Grounds. I shall take you then to see her grace. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'll just cut off his head in the middle while this guy watches. Yeah, literally cut off his head. See there? Alright, now I gotta... okay. Uh, oh, there he is. I was gonna say, Roach, why am I not being able to call you? Brave kid, Guillaume. Parmenin oversaw his upbringing. Oh. Guillaume is his kid. Uh, undergo additional Witcher mutations. That doesn't sound good. Messenger who will deliver a very interesting letter. Read it. They say Master Craftsman lives in Tucson. Special bonuses for wearing all or part of a set. Will not regret. Okay, sounds like sounds like more Witcher gear, except better. 
I guess, maybe? Okay, well, that's the intro. Um, I, I, I don't know. I, 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 I want to post it by itself, but at the same time, I feel like everyone is going to see it in other places. Can't like, get used to the way you knights talk, especially how you switch back and forth between flowery and, well, near normal. We are knights errant, in the service of her gracious magnificence. When we appear in her name or speak on her behalf, we are bound by tradition. Right. I was saying something I completely forgot about what it was. Um, I don't remember. I really, really don't remember. I guess we're here. No one here. They must have removed the body already. Let's look around. Make sure they didn't miss anything. Or they didn't get, like, captured by the guy. Oh, I forgot to check the... Yeah, so I uninstalled all my mods because just, well, nearly all of the mods. I got rid of the like, that dirty lens effect. I've got slot, slot, slots, which lets me use a shit ton of slots. So I've got, I'm running a combat build mostly. Uh, these are everything I've got. I have every single one of these equipped. Some of them are hidden in slots like that, which is what those do. Uh, let's see, here's what I got here. I need to get a, a place of power thing so I can utilize that. Anyway, so I'm I'm gonna plan on going Such as modless as possible. Hold on. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm also running better trophies because vanilla trophies are just shit, man. They are terrible. So those are the three mods I'm running. I'm gonna try to run lighter than I did in my original playthrough and the Hearts of Stone th playthrough. Um, because I want to experience all the new UI changes and such. Because a lot of them are really nice. Alright, so what are we looking for? Oh, there, there it is. It's right there on the map. Oh, right, red. Hobnail boots, multiple sets of prints. Ducal guard, clearly. Let's see where they went. So, yeah. Walked along the shoreline. If you want an That's idea... The lay on the bank. If you want an idea of what my, my somewhat colored blindness is, it's really hard for me to see that red on that green. Like, I can see it just because it's, like, wavery, but other than that, it's really hard for me to see. I can see it, it's just not very... distinct. Alright, gonna have to face drowners. Guests. Careful. Skurvers? Okay. But they're basically drowners. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do exactly, but okay. I like how it gives... Oh man, the adrenaline points work so much better now. You can actually tell when you're close to a new one. Oh, these are... Okay. Jeez. That's great. I love it. I'm... Whoa! Drawn here by the smell of blood. Let's keep looking. Oh, the, uh, another mod I'm going to have to use is auto loot. Once that's fixed... God, this is obnoxious. Yeah, definitely gonna need auto loot. Definitely gonna need auto loot. I guess we're going back? Only blood-soaked scraps left of the victim's clothing. Good quality cloth. A wealthy victim, correct? Looks it. Yeah, I would imagine so. So are just all of these just footprints? Can I not look at them? Uh, or, or, let me... Anything taken by the current ends up in these shallows. Yes. The stench is fierce. Junk that came down the river. We must keep searching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hit it by accident. I guess that's not where I need to be looking. Junk, junk, and more junk. Yep, that's about that's about my summation too. What else am I looking for? Ah, that's that's blood. Guardsmen pulled these nets out of the water, then cut the mutilated body free. Okay. Why can I not dive in? Make sure they didn't miss anything. Uh, dive. All right, there's a chest. Some florins. Uh, is this anything? Nope, just linen. Handkerchief monogrammed with whatever. Really, there's still more stuff to see. What a broken ore? Why did I loot that? Okay. Let's see. A noble's accessory, clearly. Need to comb the bank. Still? 
Like, that, that objective hasn't changed, so sure. It's the footsteps, right? Notice That's... anything interesting? Alas, nothing. Of course not. There we go. That's what I was missing. Look, a boat was launched here. Guardsmen must have loaded the body parts onto it, taken them somewhere. Need to find out where. I'd like to look at the corpse before it starts to decompose. The inn. Its patrons must have seen the guardsmen. Which direction they took. <laughs> we should ask there. They seem to be pretty interested in watching us from there. Oh, someone hooded. That's probably yeah. Someone's watching us. No shit. Seems we've got ourselves an audience. You think this surprising? The locals will tell the children of children they do not have yet. <laughs> Today, a quartered corpse was pulled from the river. Uh, I have a feeling there's going to be a lot more talk about something else in their future. One thing, found a handkerchief in the water, monogrammed D L C. Mean anything to you? Delacroix? Delacroix? Could be. Was it he the beast slew? Seems so. Mm. Knew him well. Or someone well, who had his scarf we thing. We were close friends once, but our paths diverged. He was a man of extremes. Standing by his companions, no matter the odds. Fighting his foes to the bitter end. Foes? You have a lot of them? He did. But I do not see what that has to do with the beast. Ah, Geralt. You've struck a raw nerve. Memories of a time long past, to which I'd rather not return now. Well, I understand. It's not my we can fault. Talk later. Let's go to the tavern. I just, I'm just deliver, I'm just delivering of bad news. Return to court. Barely got back to Tucson. A knight in the service of her illustrious highness knows no rest. In fact, I feared I would return too late to fulfill my duty. Yet it seems I've arrived in the nick of time. Uh-huh. Your armor looks cool, dude. Too bad it's probably heavy and... I don't... Oh, I'm following him. Okay. Thought I was on my own. Unfortunately, I'm not. Once you have finished examining the corpse, be sure to report to Anarietta. Anarietta? Her Grace, the Duchess. I forget myself at times. We address each other by our first names in private. Never in Pomrin's presence, however. He finds such familiarity offensive. Yeah, I'm sure that she is probably the one that was in the hood walking oh, by. A watering hole for traders, smugglers, boatmen. But you will find no better crayfish chowder in all Tucson. Tucson. He doesn't even say the N. Like, it, he doesn't... Like, I understand not saying the T, but the N, it's like, he kind of... They kind of gloss over the N. Can we... Yes, thank you. By my troth, could that be the musty scent of fresh pate? Pate? Not else, Sir de Peyrac Peyron. I see time has not dulled your senses. We would be honored if you would join us. Uh, your companion as well. But why do I not detect even a whiff of crayfish chowder? No soup today, on account of there being no crayfish. I reckon you've not heard. But all I caught was a corpse. Now I would put a damper on things. At the crack of dawn, as I do each day. But when I looked up, I beheld a blood red sky. This corpse is precisely why we're here. For the man whom you've invited to join you at the table was summoned from a far off land by her gracious magnificence. He is tasked with tracking and killing the beast. How far off are we talking we here? We invited two men to join us, yet since Sir the Peyrac Peyron in temperament is more akin to hare than hound, I surmise the other is the hunter. Uh, with yeah. do we have the pleasure? Uh, Milton introduced me already? No, he didn't. I guess Name sort count. of. A humble introduction. You've clearly not tarried long with Sir the Peyrac Peyron. That Geralt's just not that kind of person. Geralt is a master of the witchery trade. He has questions concerning the beast's last victim. I was the one to find the corpse. The sun had just risen when I awoke, sat straight up in my bed, looked out the window, and beheld a sky red as blood. Which doesn't tell me anything. Master, please, or we shall be here till winter. <laughs> so basically, you want me to cut straight to the ch uh, chase. Sky was red, then what? Must have been early in the morning. Why not here at all? Check your nets and then 
I stepped out of my hut and saw the corpse. By my truth, to the point, man. You found a body ensnared in your crayfish nets. We know this already. What happened then? Did you see anyone nearby? Did you spy anything noteworthy? Anything at all? Not a soul around, just me. As for noteworthy... <laughs> the dagger in your hand? What did you see? But be warned, if I hear the sky <laughs> was red again... I saw... A head bobbing, eyes bulging, the tongue blew and popped out. Next to it, a hand rocking upon the water. Get a good look at the body parts. They gave me such a fright. I bolted of course. To town fast as my legs would take me. Then returned with guardsmen who told me to keep out of their way. They had a hard haul. The parts were so tangled up in my nets, they were forced to cut them. Yeah, sounds about right. And of course, that will destroy any evidence. Where's the body? The body. Before no, it decomposes. It. They ferried it across, then loaded it on a cart and hauled it to a cellar at Corfo Bianco to keep it cool, see? What? There she Why is again. Corfo Bianco is Baron Rossell's estate. When he learns they've turned his cellar into a morgue, he'll set his hounds on them. While you were caliphanting <laughs> there he goes. the north, his vineyard was auctioned off. Hmm. Who was that? Woman who just left. Didn't see her before. Didn't notice her walk in either. Doubtless she was already in. The innkeeper's daughter. But hold, Geralt, because this is an outrage. Rossell's vineyard was auctioned off? Inconceivable. It is no secret the Baron had gambling debts up to his ears. It finally came time to collect. His creditors auctioned off his property. The Ducal Chancellery bought it, in fact. Rossell now bunks with his brother in Vico Faro. I told Rossell he'd get his comeuppance. How long can one draw on past heroics? His creditors must finally have to find that his promises meant nothing. Such are the times. Today's knights are pale shadows of the heroes of yore. It's true what they say. God sent the beast to punish us for straying uh, from the paths. No, it, no, it didn't. No, it didn't. Saying the beast's divine punishment? Yeah, what is this nonsense? So folk think the beast's divine punishment. Knights have turned their backs on the old customs. Where they were defenders of the duchy, they're now defenders of their own tushes. Why, you insolent. Let him talk. The duchess traits in titles, grants honors to ill to us. We've strayed from the path of virtue, lost the gods' favor, so the gods sent retribution. Don't no. listen to that nonsense, Geralt. It's rehashed street preacher Codsworth. Yes, the rebel rousers have been sprouting up like weeds lately, each offering the same bill of goods. I, yeah, it's all about how you perceive it, and neither side is correct. It's a mid always something in the middle. It's never black and white. What else do they say about the beast? Did they say anything else about the beast? Besides it being a messenger of the gods. The two Chantois are no fools. They see clearly the beast kills on days honoring patron saints. Picky huh. monster. And he only goes for higher ups. Okay. Uh, I gotta examine Thanks the body. For the hospitality. Time I examined the corpse. Covo Bianco lies a short way from here, near the tourney grounds. Just follow the road and you'll arrive. Not coming with? Oh, yeah. Duty of some sort calls. Some sort? <laughs> Her grace bestowed a great honor on me, even before we departed for Velen. I'm to play the hare during this year's game in the palace gardens. When you see me in my costume, you will wet yourself laughing. I wouldn't go that far. I to ask a few questions, but it sounds like a long, complicated story. One involving lengthy digressions into local history and tradition. So, see you later, Milton. And good luck. Which I don't have time for right now, apparently. Uh-huh. Okay, so is the innkeeper's daughter gonna stop me as I walk out the door here? Maybe? No? Come on! You know that's how that's supposed to work. Oh wait, notice board's back here. How did I miss I this notice board? A dope be Not a, a said he was. So, is that... Whatever. 
Uh, wanted the White Wolf, not Geralt, I assume. Uh, some notice announcement. Gwent tournament. Oh boy, Gwent. For a Witcher, Witchers, Caravans, Escort. I don't think an Escort. Clerks looking for help. Could be good coin to be made. Yeah, I. Wait, wait. Oh. Oh, that is me. Okay. Uh. Summon. All right. Yeah. Announcements. I like this new book layout thing they have. It's very convenient. Okay. I guess I'm just gonna call it here. We've been going a fair amount. Uh, I'm excited to dig into this. I wanted to get this episode up and out, because the sooner you do that, usually the better, even though everybody and their mother is doing this, but, you know, who, like, more searching, even though I'm small and no one gives a fuck about me, honestly, but, you know, whatever. Maybe someone will find me, and if you're new to me, thank you. If you made it this far, thank you. Especially. Yeah, uh... This is where I'm supposed to shill everything, like, comments, whatever, but honestly, that's not really my kind of thing. If you want to do it, great. I'm not going to say you have to, because we... Whatever. Doesn't matter. You can do all that stuff. You know how this works, internet. You know how this works. So next time, I don't know. I don't know what we'll do next time. Okay, yeah, thanks. Oh, hey, let's first take a look at the map. Uh... I can't zoom out any further. Okay, that's another part of the mod I'm gonna have to- another mod I'm gonna have to get. Fairly decent sized place, but still seems kind of small. I don't know, whatever, doesn't matter. We'll get to exploring someday. I don't- I don't know what we'll do next time. Next time we'll do something else. Hopefully, wanna see it next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a like. If you didn't, give it a dislike. I don't care, I'm not picky. If you have something else you want to say that's more complicated than that, you can leave a comment. And if you want to see more stuff, you can subscribe. To check out my Hearts of Stone playthrough, the previous Witcher 3 expansion, check the video up top. And for something different, but still RPG related, check out Twilight Princess HD on the bottom. Oh no, the Boar King, or whatever. He's